and welcome my fellow YouTubers, subscribers, followers, friends, and other tag readers. Today, I'm going to do a reading from the what, 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 1628 for you, Leos. Wait, before I continue this reading, I know there's a question in your mind. When are you going to do the Valentine reading, Beyond? When are you? Because, you know, it's just two days away. Well, very, 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 very soon. All right, my look at it, look at it, look at it, Leo. So it's gonna be a portrait spread. Card number one, two, three, past, four, five, six, present, seven, eight, nine, future. And card number three being the main energy of it all. And the overall. I'm gonna take the overall first so that I can relate it to the past, present, or future. So let's get hanging, Leo. Oh, excuse me. And by the way, it's gonna be a light card which just shows your aura. Like your vibe, your chi, your zhang. You know, normal stuff. Alright, my kid, little, Leo's. Alright, now let's, 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 let's do it, Leo. Let's do it, Leo. I say it. Let's do it. Card number one, two, three. Past. Card number four, five, six. Present. Card number seven, eight, nine. Future and the overall. All right, my lucky Leos. Let's do this now. So your overall energy is Queen of Wands. You need. You're enlightened. You're powered. You're very sparked up. And one second, please. All this jam is making me thirsty. As I was saying, you're enlightened, you're powered up, you're sparked up. You're ready to rumble. This Queen of Wands trusts her own intuition. She doesn't trust anything else because she knows she's right in her heart. And even though the passion is showing, the heart is still there. Pit, pie, pit. So now let's see, Cor. Let's start saying one, one, one. King of Wands, so I can immediately tell you this will relate to the past. This will relate to the Queen. The past will relate. So King of Wands is a card of having a spark, having a passion for a very long time. That means you're growing with it. You're you're sparking up with it. You're powering up with it. All right, my Leah, Oh, and by the way, Queen of Wands and King of Wands are your cards. So let's see card number two. Five of coins, and you're feeling abandoned from a place, like you're restricted, like you're the odd one out, the black horse. I can go on and on, but that was not the point. If you feel abandoned, then create your own club. You can't always be dependent on others to create a club. Like in a game, if you can't join an alliance, create an alliance. That will prove much useful. Alright, man, like a Leo, 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 Leo. All right, so now let's see the card number three, Hermit. It's a card of Virgo and a card of alone, a card of solitude, a card of trying to search your intuition, trying to search your mind for an answer, not just anybody. All right, my lalali. If I could melt your heart, Leo's. All right. Card no, major arcana number nine nine nine. So see that gleam? That's you. Now let's read it all together. You have a spark from a very long time. There's something that sparked you, something that broke, that kept you going, something that kept you moving. I got my Leo ball, my look, look Leo ball. And you're feeling abandoned from that, like you're disconnected from that. You're disconnected from the spark. So you try to, to, to church in solitude and how to reconnect to the spark. All right, my little Leo, Bio, Shio, Dio, Hio, Mio, Leos. All right, now let's see card number four. Knight of Cups. Someone is offering you a straight up love emotion. Like, ooh, baby, I love your skin. Or any flattery hooey like that. Whatever is that. Is opening an emotion, like it opening his feeling, opening his heart to something like this. I got my little. Oh. 
All right, so he's opening his heart to you. He's opening your feelings to you. Card number five is six of cups. And you're remembering memories. You're reminiscing happy moments. Emphasize happy moments. So you're remembering things that happened with you guys. With this knight of cups and this queen of wands. All right, my little Leo, 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 Leo. This seems interesting. And finally, card number six it is, six it is, six is eight of cups. And you're straight up walking away from it. Like, bye bye, Leo. Bye bye. Anyway, this eight of cups is a plain of card for walking away. As what it needed to be done is done. Now to move on to the next thing, you can't always dwell on this. Like, oh, I did this. Ooh, look at me. I'm the best. I did this. I did that. I did this. So you did it. Big deal. Woo! -hoo! Now, move on to the next thing. Now let's read your present all together, together, together. Someone is offering you a romantic opportunity, probably a Pisces, Scorpio, or Cancer. And to reminisce all good memories, to make good memories or reminisce good memories, and the, and then walks away from you. Whoa. Now that I read it out loud, it doesn't sound as good as it did in my head. Oh, well. You win some, you lose some. So let's see card number seven. Tower. So something is too top heavy. Something is too reliant on one end that it does not know what to do if it lost one. Because the tower is a card of destruction, calamity, chaos. <laughs> But this card shows that nature didn't try to destroy the tower. It tried to even the tower out because it was just plain big. A card of Scorpio and Mars. So let's see card number, 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 number. Eight. Page of coins. You're becoming a student. You're trying to learn how to make your tower the right way so it doesn't crack, crack, crack. Boom. So you're trying to learn. You're trying to become a student. You're not trying to be, I know it all. Who am I? I know it all. No. You're trying to learn. You're understanding. You want to hear other side. So now let's see card number nine. It is King of Swords. A very clear cut card. These are a very, someone you can have a conversation with. But if you don't, have the skills to talk to him okay leos so now the queen of wands relates to the past with the king all right so now let's see your now let's see your aura your light card aura light card let's see your aura light card let's see your aura light card just two more shuffles one more shuffle it is the crumbling. What are you clinging on to? The tower, silly. The same tower is showing you crumble. So if you always, like I said, don't be so dependent on one end. If the other falls, you won't know what to do. Because it will never be back with you. So, alright, my licky licky Leos. So don't be so reliant on this. Be open to other opportunities. Move with life as life moves with you. Do, 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 do. All right, so I hope you have a great Valentine. V for Vienna. Ba, 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 ba. Peace, peace, peace.